with breaking news. The verdict is in in the case of a Barrington police sergeant, Joseph Androsi, who was on trial for allegedly harassing his ex-wife, then trying to tamper with the evidence by deleting text messages on his phone remotely. Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan was in the courtroom when the decision was revealed. She joins us live now with the breaking details. Well, Jen, it was just over a week of testimony, and it took the jury just two hours to come up with its verdict, guilty on both charges. Do you find the defendant guilty or not guilty? Guilty. Barrington police officer Joseph Andriozzi seemed to flinch when the guilty verdict was read in court on Friday. The officer now convicted of obstruction of justice and cyber harassment. We clearly, strongly, vehemently deny that at any time on August 30th of 2012, then, now, or ever, that, that he had the intent, the specific intent, to in fact obstruct justice. Well, the defense claimed that Andriozzi, a skilled police officer, knew that the police had the text messages from his wife's phone when he deleted his remotely. Take photos of the text messages because I have very personal information on the cell. The prosecution says that was not the case, that Andriozzi was trying to destroy evidence on the phone as it was locked up at state police headquarters. No one is above the law. Not a police officer not a citizen of this state. The prosecution used much of its closing argument to focus on the cyber harassment, including multiple text messages sent between the couple where Andriozzi seemed aggressive. In the end, the jury did not believe Andriozzi's defense. Now, Andriozzi has been on leave without pay pending the outcome of this trial. We did reach out to the Barrington Police Chief this afternoon to see what his status would be. We're still waiting word back on that. Live in the newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.